Hi, it's Gord Cook here at the Cook Family Cottage Project. I'm here again with uh, Derek Seaman. Uh, Derek, one of the things that you do a lot of is insulated sheathing. That's right, yeah. All your projects, uh, inch and a half, two inch, where are you at these days? Two inch on most projects. And on this particular project, we're using a two and a half inch. Was it two and a half? Two and a quarter. Two and a quarter. And always my concern or question, I guess, is what do we do with the windows? Do you nail through or attach through this foam on the nailing fence? Is that typical for you? That's typically how we do it. And we have ran into a few issues with uh, the window flange sinking into the foam a little bit. So a little compresses. So what I want to do is in this little segment is highlight this cool product called Thermobot. Thermopuck is a structural uh, foam product that also has a, a, a water inhibiting layer on it. So this really creates, as you can see here, the opening for that window that's already watertight and now the foam can butt up to this. Now in this case, this is designed for three inch and this foam was two and a half. So we ended up with just a little, it's not quite, you'll see it's just a little bit uh, sunken in here, which isn't ideal, but the concept here is now I'm able to finish off the nailing flange is actually gonna screw back through here. I think you said- Five inch screws. Five inch screws. So it's a cool product called Thermobuck, mitered corners. What was your thoughts, Derek? How did it go? I thought it worked pretty well. Uh, I think it installed fairly quickly and easily and a little bit of caulking in the corners and uh, went on nice. So a cool little company, Thermobuck, that's really trying to help builders meet these challenges of insulated sheeting on the outside of buildings. For more information, just go to thermobuck.com.